hello everyone welcome to my channel free hacking tutorial so in this video i am going to show you how to add watermarks on multiple photos automatically using gimp photo editor so let's begin so first of all you have to download and install a plugin called bimp or batch image manipulation plugin for gimp so to get the plugin go to or open any web browser and type in google search bimp and press enter so now click on this website link to get the plugin so this plugin is a bit image manipulation plugin for GIMP so to use this plugin you have to or you should have already installed GIMP software in your system so so if you don't have GIMP photo editor already installed in your systems then you can get the GIMP photo editor by clicking here and you will and this will redirect to its official website and from here you can download and install the GIMP photo editor so this photo editor is a free and open source photo editor so you can use this software without any restrictions or without any limitation so firstly download and install this photo editor from this website and after after that go to this website link and download and install this plugin that is BIMP or batch image manipulation plugin for GIMP and you can use this plugin in Windows as well as Mac OS so let's open GIMP software now when you open GIMP photo editor for the first time so you will see this similar interface in your screen so now click on file and click here batch image manipulation now you will see like this same pop-up windows in your screen now to add now you have to click on add or click on plus symbol and you will see all this option so this plugin can be used to resize a photo or crop a photo or flip or rotate or color corrections so you can use all these features by using this plugin so this video is all about adding watermark so i'll show you how to add a watermark so click here to add a watermark now you'll see this two option text watermark and image watermark so to add a text watermark click here and to add a image watermark select here and click here to add your image to add as a watermark in the photo so now i'll show you how to add a text watermark so click here to add a text watermark so now type in this text box so i'll type here my name now click here to change the font style from this list you can select the font and from here you can change or decrease the or increase the size of the font or you can manually type here and press ok now you can change the color of the text by clicking here you can change or select the color you can also sense or decrease the opacity or transparency of the watermark by sliding this bar to the left 
and this is the option for position of the watermark to select a position where you want in which direction you want to add your watermark select this positions so I want to add on the center or on the right side on the middle of the right side so I'll click here and click OK and now I have two options add images and remove images so I have to add image first so click here and to add the single image click here and to add multiple image so click here to add multiple image so now select the folder that contains your photos so I will select my folder that contains all my photos and click it and click apply or you can sense the output folder by clicking here now so I'll select the D drive as my output folder and create a new folder under this folder I will want to save my watermark images I'll name my folder as watermark so click OK now click apply now you have to wait for few minutes to get the process to be done so once it's done you will see this type of message in this section now let's move to D drive to see the watermark image so you can see here my image so let's open this image so you can see here here is my watermark in my photographs let's see another image so you can see here a small watermarks in the photo So that's how you can add watermarks on multiple photo at the same time using GIMP photo editor in Windows or Mac OS. So I hope this video is useful for you. So if you are finding this video information useful for you, click on the like button and subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon for the latest updates and thanks for watching my video.